Hi, I'm Mark. I've uploaded uh, some of my compositions on this channel. And one of them is Free Range Fellow, where we're talking about organic, organic living. We are what we eat, right? And uh, I just want to uh, share with you the lost world of laser discs, and because they are a source of a lot of really organic music which has never been released on DVD or CD. And down here we we have some of the more stuff relevant to to what I'm going to show in subsequent episodes here. So here we have Bob Dylan. Now you can see there's uh, Japanese stickers. These are all Japan Japanese NTSC discs. Um, because they were much more enthusiastic and they had much more market success in Japan. 10% of households compared with the US. And as a result, or as a cause, uh, they released a much greater range of music titles. I expect a lot of these titles are very limited release issues. But um, that's what makes it so interesting. So I, I want to just very quickly skim through what we'll be looking at in subsequent episodes. Now, some of this stuff is available currently on YouTube, but it, it's, the source is not identified in the way that I'm doing today. And uh, I'm pumping the sound through my own sound system which we have a Pioneer player over there and a Rustic amplifier, German Rustic amplifier uh, and the, the speakers are uh, Face Technology PC 8.5s when, when they were still made in the US so and they have quite a good sound but this this highlights the, uh, the, the issue this was a uh, a tour in 1996 uh, when Bob Dylan felt he was at a, a, a low in his life, in his career perhaps, uh, but he produces great performances in this, particularly intense and at the same time very relaxed with the audience, the Sydney audience, and they aren't always the most forthcoming, but uh, it, it, it's, it's a great show. and. Never been released on DVD or CD. Southside Johnny. Final track, he's joined up uh, by uh, uh, Bruce Springsteen and Stevie Von Sound because they're performing in New Jersey. <laughs> no surprise there. Great stuff. Uh, I've never seen this on uh, any other format. Dr. John and his prime. We'll do uh, wrong place, right time from that. This is a history of rock and roll, which I think might be available on DVD and stuff. The best history that I've come across is about 10 discs. <coughs> but the, the DVD version doesn't have this great pressure. Huh? For Rolling Stones documentary. Not available elsewhere. I've got a lot of Stevie Ray on. I just reading, I'm not sure if this is available, where he has that great performance uh, of Sam and Dave. Here we have three great blues guitarists uh, and they are playing at Carnegie Hall. Any place you'll find it. Early Fleetwood Mac. I'll be featuring a Peter Green performance here that is not on YouTube. And I looked last anyway. Great performances here where you have people teaming up, such as uh, Aaron Neville and Trisha Yearwood, Little Richard and Tanya Tucker, P Patty LaBelle and Travis Stritt, uh, Al Green and Lyle Lovett. Oh, I love it. 
Neil Young's Unplugged. Same story. Even these uh, David Bowie videos, video collection. No corresponding DVD, but I'm aware of the last time I looked. Blues. Blues. History of Alligator Records. The History of Chess Records. Uh, here I'll be featuring a performance of Savoy Brown because they have a great guitarist in Ken Simmons. Blues. And this is a great performance uh, at a James of Albert Collins with Joe Walsh and his band. John Hammond Jr. goes through the Delta looking for Robert Johnson. John Lee Hooker in his prime. Charlie Musselwhite. Now we have more of the series, the Super Sessions, which uh, for one on the turntable is of. Uh, this one, they couple B.B. Uh, King with people like Eric Clapton, Paul Butterfield, Dr. John, and so forth. I'll be featuring uh, the version of A Thrill Is Gone, B.B. with Eric, similarly here. Uh, Latin greats. This features uh, an astonishing performance of Sarah Vaughan doing uh, Sin and the Clowns. And here I'll be featuring the Neville Brothers where Carlos Santana plays <coughs> comes in with his guitar, but I'll also uh, do uh, Grace Jones doing My Jamaica Going. New Orleans, New Orleans, or Stevie Ray Vaughan. Okay, so without more ado, I will start for performance, and uh, I will be doing, I'll show you how it goes. Okay. So that's what it looks like. It's a Pioneer player, 30 years old, LD98 it is. It's the first of their player, players, I think, to also play CDs, and it's, it's my CD player as well. This has never required any repairs in 30 years. <coughs> the Rustic did require new valves after a hard working life. So, here we go. So, the tracks I'll be featuring here will be James Brown doing How Do You Stop? And then I'm coupled with Wilson Pickett doing Cold Sweat and then with Aretha Franklin. But at first the performers talk about that. Tonight, from Detroit, Cinemac proudly present a soul session with the godfather of soul, Mr. James Brown and friends, starring the queen of soul, Miss Aretha Franklin, Mr. Joe Cocker, Mr. Robert Palmer, Mr. Vinera, and the mighty Mr. Wilson Wicked Pickett. Uh, I think it's just wonderful to uh, be able to come here to be with the uh, the Godfather of Soul. You know, I'm glad it ain't the, it ain't the other Godfather. You know? Yeah, I think there's only James and Wilson to really do that scream, that one that you go. Maybe because you say it. <laughs> when Joe Cocker reached back to uh, to grab a note, looked like he's straining everything he got in his body. You know, <laughs> you know, it takes contemporary television to provide the opportunity to do something like this. James and I never 
toured together or never had the opportunity to do anything together. But tonight, there's nobody oh, good for <laughs>